Hello? Oh, uh, hi. Hello, everyone. Hi, hi. Welcome, welcome. Welcome to the stream. How's everyone? Hope everyone's chilling. Hope everyone's doing fine. Ooh, I cannot hear the music at all. Now it's too loud. There you go. Is that good? Is that good for the music chat? There you go. Hi, hi, you boy. How you doing? Hey, baby girl. Hey, I'm still sick. Damn, that's crazy. But yeah, uh, is that good? Is that good? That should be good. That should be good. If it's not good, then I'll like piss myself to sleep. Ugh, my PC is not enjoying something. Could it be the Stanley Parable? Oh, my VTube studio is not enjoying itself. My PC is just not enjoying itself at all right now. I'm so sorry, chat. Hold on. Hold on. Let me, let me, let me, let me fix something. I haven't came to stream in a while. Yo, welcome back. Welcome, welcome. Glad to have you here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, it's just, it's just not liking that I'm playing the Stanley Parable. It's, it's, it's been, it's been, it's been a bitch. For a while now. I'm also like not having the best Wi-Fi right now. It's gonna be a scuff day, chat. It's, it's, it's gonna be one of those scuff days. Hope it's better. Why is your piss green? No, I said yellow or green. Doesn't mean that it is green. Ooh, it's definitely not enjoying that. Hold on. Morning cow, hello cow, hello, hello. Uh, my, my stream, it's just like not enjoying. It's, it's, it's not enjoying itself. It hates itself. Right now. I'm preparing a surprise for you on Sunday. Ayo. Ayo, ayo, ayo. Hold on. I think it has something to do with the game. Which means you have to start immediately. So I can show you the game. Oh god. Oh, I'm just not having the best Wi-Fi today. Ooh, yikes. Oh, everything... Everything is going to shit, chat. Everything is going to shit. Oh, I'm shitting myself. So far, it feels great. Ayo, hey, let's go. Where is that Stanley Parabell? Now you can hear everything. Why is this thing so long? Okay. Have you played... Nope, I have not. Hold on. Oh, slider. I was stealing your Wi Fi for a second? Damn. That's crazy. I'll put it at. I'll put it at that. Because I struggle seeing things as is. You know? Oh, God. I am lagging. What time is it? It is 7 02. It is 7 02 p.m. 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 Okay, confirm. It's 10 p.m. for me? Damn, that's crazy. Okay. So, you yeah, know, my stream is like shitting itself. I'm so sorry, chat. Let me... Is that too loud? Let me pause the music. Uh, V-Sync is on. Dude, my PC is just shitting itself right now. It's a bit too loud. I get that. Okay, hold on. Hold on. There you go. Yeah, no, my PC is shitting itself today. It's shitting itself so bad. Quality, I'll put it at medium. Uh. Yeah, okay. I th I th Are we good now? Why is it still shitting itself? Is this a horror game? This is not a horror game. Goober has entered. Hey, yo, what's up, Minty Fox? How you doing today? Hope you're chilling. Yeah, uh, I don't. I don't know why we're having technical difficulties today. My PC has been screaming since the morning, so uh, you know, not looking forward to that. Global warming is also rising to a significant extent. Also, not enjoying that. This game's not gonna dox me, is it? I feel like this is one of those type of games that, like, can dox you. 
you know? <laughs> it's gonna like show my entire address on stream or something. Okay, I, th I think we're smoother now. Yeah, question mark. I, I don't know, it just feels like one of those games where you can just, just dox you, you know? Anyways, I'll begin the game. <laughs> it feels like one of those games. You know, you know that like stinky, stinky feeling you have in a game? You feel like it might. This is the story of a man named Stanley. Stanley worked for a company in a big building where he was employee number 427. Employee number 427's job was simple. He sat at his desk in room 427 and he pushed buttons on the keyboard. Orders came to him through a monitor on his desk, telling him what buttons to push, how long to push them, and in what order. This is what employee 427 did every day of every month of every year. And although others might have considered it soul-rending, Stanley relished every moment that the orders came in, as though he had been made exactly for this job. Damn. Wait, are we playing as Stanley? Was happy. So I, I I know nothing about the Stanley Parable. Are, are we and playing as Stanley? Day, something <laughs> very peculiar happened. Something that would forever change Stanley. Hello, baby Peach. Something Hello. Something he would never quite forget. Pay you a visit? Don't look under your bed. He had been okay. At his desk for nearly an hour when he realized. Oh, I skipped it. No. What the hell? I didn't mean to do that. Shit. Why do I make typing noises when I- okay. I do that for free. Oh my god, okay, All I sure- All co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. I sure hope it doesn't. Cause my school- my school's in there! I'm gonna get doxxed! I hope- No matter how hope hard I don't. Stanley looked, he couldn't find a trace of his co-workers. Oh, what's this? Oh. Oh. Okay. Cool. Last stream. L last stream? Forever? Oh, okay. Can I turn it back on or? No, it just stays off. Do I get to turn everything off? It is a bit too smooth. Stanley went around touching oh. every little thing in the office, but it didn't make a single difference. Nor did it advance the story in any way. Shut up. I like touching things. I hate m Mondays. Yeah, me too, man. I hate Fridays the most, actually. <laughs> How are you feeling today? Ah, oh, you know. When Stanley Fucking hell, it's Friday. set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. I'm gonna pull the door on the right. <laughs> this was ha! not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. Yeah, I do, actually. What's in here? Ah, yes. Truly a room worth admiring. I hate this. It had really been worth the detour after all, just to spend a few mo- Hello, is this a horror game? It is- it's- okay. I don't think it's a horror game. It's not supposed to be a horror game. If it is, then we're fucked. Someone's here in this immaculate, beautifully constructed room. Stanley simply stood here, drinking it all in. Hi, Kamli. No worries. Welcome, welcome. What is that? What is that? Can I have it? Can I have it? Can I have it? Can I have it? Can I squat? Can I? How do I squat? Can I have it? Can I have it? Can I have it? No. Okay. I hope yes. it's a horror game. Fuck you, Evo. Really, really worth it being here in the room. A room so utterly captivating that even though all your co-workers Fucking have mysteriously it. vanished, here you sit looking at these chairs and some paint. But eager to get back to business. Stanley took the first open <gasps> door on his left. Haha, uh, same, same as in like... You want this and to be so a horror game? And so he through the maintenance section, walked straight ahead to the opposite door, and got back on track. Okay. What are we... what are we doing? Hello? Yet there was not a single person here either. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office, hoping he might find an answer there. Oh. Okay, I'll take note of that. I wasn't paying attention. What did he say? Yes, I want it to be a horror game. Well, I hate you. You hate me? Yeah, I do. No, no, I don't. No, not you. Not you. No, no. Wolfie, you know, I could never hate you. Hi, hi, Naruto. Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's office. 
Ooh, fancy. You're playing Stanley Parable? I am. So, uh, first time I'm playing this. I sure hope I don't throw up in the middle of the game. I feel like that's something very plausible. Stepping into his manager's office, Stanley was once again stunned Kaka to discover not an indication exposed. of any human life. Shocked, unraveled, Stanley wondered in disbelief who orchestrated this. Ooh. What dark secret was being held from ooh, him? Ooh, 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 ooh. What he could not have known was that the keypad behind the boss's desk guarded oh, the terrible truth Shit. that his boss had been keeping from him. And so the boss had assigned it an extra secret pin number. Two, eight, oh, four, five. Two, but of course, eight, Stanley couldn't four, possibly have known five. this. Yippee! Yet incredibly, by simply pushing random buttons. Am I gonna get keypad, squished? Stanley happened to input the correct code. Oh no! By sheer luck. Amazing. <laughs> he stepped into the newly opened passageway. Wow. I am sick today. Hi, sick today. I'm cow. Wow, I hate this. Maybe it is a horror game. What is this? I'll go down. I don't like this. I don't like this. Whoa, nice guess. Thank you. Thank you. I know. Uh, kind of a guesser myself, you know. My parents, uh, when they when they first Descending born me, I was building, like, I know exactly Sammy what you're going to name me. He felt a bit peculiar. It was a stirring of emotion in his chest, as though he felt more free to think for himself, to question the nature of his job. Why did he feel this now? When for years it had never occurred to him. I don't know. This question would not go unanswered for long. Hey, genuine question? Do you get to romance a narrator in this game? Like, can you like I don't know, like make Stanley walked straight ahead through the large door that read okay. Mind Control Facility. Escape. Mind control facility. <laughs> This isn't Detroit Become Human. Shut up! The lights rose on an enormous room packed with television screens. Wow. What horrible secret did this place hold? This is like X-Men. Wait, this is like X-Men. To find out. Or like the Star Wars. <laughs> I'm gonna bust the nut from his voice, bro. Kira, every day I wake up and I remember you're one of my viewers and I feel slightly worse about myself. No, no, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I, I'm lying. I, I, I like lying. Now the monitors jumped oh. to life. Their true nature revealed. Each bore the number of an empire. Wait, which one? Where's mine? Where's mine? Stanley's co-workers. The lives of so many individuals reduced to images on a screen. And Stanley, one of them, eternally monitored in this place. Wait, which one's mine? Which one's mine? 427. That one. That one's mine. Wow, why is mine so much like darker than the rest? Okay, yo bro, what's up Jinsei? How you doing today? Duh. In the elevator. This mind control facility, it was too horrible to believe. It couldn't be true. Had Stanley really been under someone's control all this time? Was this the only reason he was happy with his boring job? Oh, hello? That his emotions had been manipulated to accept it blindly? It could be that. Or it could be the sexy narrator narrating everything I do. No. He oh, refused uh? to believe okay, it. Okay. He couldn't accept it. I guess His I can't accept life it. life in someone else's control? Never. It oh, was okay. unthinkable. Wasn't it? Okay. Was it even possible? I guess, I guess it is. Had he truly spent his entire life utterly blind I can't to the see world? anything. Girly pop, I'm blind. But oh. here was the proof. The heart of the operation. Controls labeled with emotions. Happy. On, or sad, on, 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 or content. On, on, walking, on, on, eating, on, working. On, on, all of it on, monitored on, and commanded on. from click, this click, click, very click, click. place. And okay. as the cold reality of his past began to sink in, Stanley decided that this machinery would never again exert its terrible power over another human life. For he would dismantle the controls once and for Oh, I get all. it. We click the red one, and then we click the red one. That did nothing. Okay, I'm fucking stupid. I'm sorry. Cow cow, yeah. I'm gonna watch on my phone a, a bit. Be right back. Okay, have a nice. <laughs> the hell's going on? I don't know. Do I look like someone who has more than three brain cells? Hi, hello, Maya. How you doing? Why is it offline? What is this? Console disabled. How do I enable it? 
Do, do I have to click all the red ones? There's only red. I mean, there's a red one for most of them. Maybe I have to click the bl blue one? What? I don't know. Thank you for the fall, Puppy Rose. I highly appreciate it. Oh. <laughs> yeah, that makes sense. Five. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. Duh. What's poppin'? Good, good, good. And when at last he found On. the source. Oh, Stanley. You didn't just activate the controls, did you? I did. After they kept you enslaved all these years, you go and you try to take control of the machine for yourself. Is yeah. that what you wanted? Control? Yeah. Oh, Stanley. I applaud Are you going to come and do? But you need to understand, there's only so much that machine can do. You were supposed to let it go, turn the controls off, and leave. If you want to throw my story off track, you're going to have to do much better than that. What are you going to do I'm to me? You don't have nearly <laughs> the power you think you do, for example, and I believe you'll find this pertinent. Stanley suddenly realized he had just initiated the network's emergency detonation system. In the event that this machine is activated without proper DNA identification, nuclear detonators are set to explode, eliminating the entire complex. What? Not long until detonation then, Mm, let's say huh? two minutes. Ah, now this is making things a little more fun, isn't it, Stan? What? What did I do wrong? What did I do wrong? I didn't know what I do wrong. What the fuck? Huh? 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 Shape it can, to your can, can I just desires. turn it off oh, again? This is much better than huh? what I had in mind. Okay. Oh, oh no. Okay. Off, off. I can't. Okay. Never mind. I lied. I can't turn it off. Cow, run. Cow, what did you? I don't know what I did. I don't know what I did. I did something wrong, and I was regret to do it. I don't know what to do. 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 We have to go to the button. What's that? You'd like to know where your co-workers are? Button hit. A moment of solace before green, you're obliterated. Green? Green. All right, I'm in a good mood. You're gonna die anyway. I'll tell you exactly what happened to them. I erased them. I turned off the machine. I set you free. God, his voice is hot. Of course, no, that was cow bad. in this instance of the story. Ooh, this Sometimes is when I tell two? it, I simply let you sit there in your office forever, pushing buttons endlessly and then dying alone. Other times, I let the office sink into the ground, swallowing huh? everyone huh? inside. Huh? I let it burn to a crisp. The voices, cause anxiety so, initiated. This version of events huh? has been rather huh? amusing. Watching you try to make sense of everything and take huh? back the control huh? rest huh? away from huh? me. It's huh? I almost hate to see it go. Click, 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 click. Click, 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 no. My goodness, only 34 seconds left. But I'm enjoying this so much. Huh? You know what? To hell with it. I'm going to put uh, some uh, uh, extra time on the clock. Why not? Uh, huh? Huh? These are huh? precious huh? additional seconds, huh? Stanley. Time doesn't huh? grow on trees. House. Uh, oh, dear yellow. Me. What's Gre the matter, green? Stanley? Is it that you have green? no idea where five. you're going? No, or what the you're five. To the be five. Doing right now? I know where or the did five you just is. just assume when you saw that timer that something in this room was capable of turning it off? I mean, look One, at you. Running two, from button to button, three, screen to screen, four, clicking on every little five. thing in this Stop room. taunting me! I'm gonna come! It's colored ones. Or maybe this big red button. Or this door. Everything, oh, oh, there's things on it. Wait, there's things on it. Me. Wait. Why would you say oh, that, Stanley? Oh, okay, cool. That this video uh, game uh, can be beaten? Uh, One uh -huh. solved? Do you have any idea huh? what your purpose in this huh? place is? Huh? <laughs> no! <laughs> huh? <laughs> Stop you're laughing! You're gonna you're make me on. come! But here's a spoiler for you. <laughs> that timer isn't a catalyst to keep the action moving along. It's just like, seconds to get away to your Green? Death. You're only still Red? playing instead of watching a cutscene. Okay, I guess I not. Huh? For every moment that you're powerless. Huh? To see you made humble. This is not it's... a challenge. It's a tragedy. No. You wanted to control huh? this world, huh? that's fine. Huh? Huh? But I'm going to destroy it first. So Wait, okay, no. Can't. Four? Oh, okay, there Take I go. The clock stand. Uh, that's 30 uh, seconds uh, you have uh, left to struggle. Uh, 30 uh, seconds until a uh, big boom. Uh, then uh, uh, no uh, energy. Uh, Just uh, one big blow. Uh, 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 will you uh, cling desperately uh, to your frail life? Or will you let it go peacefully? Chillax, I can't chillax, I'm gonna die. 
It's all the same to me, all a part of the joke. And believe me, I what? will be laughing What's the back at every of power? second of your inevitable What's? life What's the back from of the power? moment we fade in there? until the moment I there? say happily ever up. I okay, I don't know what the hell that was. I did something wrong. 24 minutes and you already died. I don't know what I did wrong. I don't All really of his co-workers were gone. Okay. What could it mean? Right, keep going. Just keep Stanley going. decided to go to the meeting. I'll obey. I'll Perhaps obey. He had simply missed a memo. I'll obey. I'll obey. I'll obey. I'll when obey. Stanley came to a set I'll of obey. two I'll open doors. He I'll obey. The door I'll obey. I'll obey. I'll obey. I'll obey, I'll obey, I'll obey, I'll obey, I promise. I'll Yet obey. there was not a single person here either. <laughs> Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley decided to go up to his okay. boss's office, hoping he might find a coming to a staircase. Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's office. Okay. Stepping into his manager's office, Stanley was once again stunned to discover not an indication of any human life. What could it mean? Stanley wondered aloud to nobody. He began wildly tearing through papers on the boss's desk, pulling books off the shelf, looking behind paintings, desperate for clues to his situation. But his attention was caught by a keypad behind the boss's desk. What could its purpose be? Regardless. In fact, this keypad like guarded the terrible secret huh? that lay buried below his feet. And so the boss had assigned it an extra secret pin number. Two, two eight, two, four, five. Eight, four, but of course, five. Stan, yet incredibly, by simply pushing random buttons on the keypad, Stan yeah. happened to input the correct code by sheer luck. Amazing. He stepped into the newly opened passageway. Yeah. Yeah, this isn't... Creepy at all. Yeah. Back back down. There we go. We got this. And I'll obey this time. I'll 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 be I'll, I'll listen to the never. Stanley walked straight ahead through the large door that read Mind Control Facility. Uh -huh. And then we go through everything again. We got this. The lights rose on an enormous room packed with television screens. What horrible secret did this place hold? Stanley thought to himself. Did he have the strength to find out? Chad, do you think the narrator's single? Now the monitors jumped to life, their true nature revealed. Each bore the number of an employee in the building. Stanley's co-workers. The lives of so many individuals reduced to images on a screen. And Stanley, one of them, eternally monitored in this place where freedom meant oh. nothing. Okay, now we got this. And we'll this go and I will listen facility. and then we, we'll, we won't die. It was horrible to believe it couldn't be true. Had Stanley really been under someone's control all this Whoa. time? Was this the only reason he was happy with his boring job? That his emotions had been manipulated to accept it blindly? Okay. No. He refused to believe it. He couldn't accept it. His own life in someone else's control? Never. It was unthinkable. Wasn't it? Was it even possible? Had he truly spent his entire life utterly blind yes. to the world? Ooh, okay. But here was the proof. The heart of the operation. We Controls go to the facility labeled power. with emotions. Happy, or sad, yeah. or content. Walking, eating, and working. Then we, all of it monitored and commanded. We turn it off, very right? And as the cold reality of his past began to sink in, Stanley decided that this machinery would never again... Oh! Wait, did I do it? Yay! I... I win? I win the game! I... I... Blackness. And a rising chill of uncertainty. I didn't win the game. Okay. Was it over? Understandable. 
I get that. Yes. He had won. I did! He had defeated the machine. Unshackled himself from someone else's command. Freedom was mere moments away. And yet, even as the immense door slowly opened, Stanley reflected on how many puzzles still lay unsolved. Where had his co-workers gone? Hey, hi, Cal, how are you? Been freed from the machine. You never feel the mess up. Shut what up! What other mysteries did this strange building hold? But as sunlight streamed into the chamber, he realized none of this mattered to him. For it was not knowledge or even power that he had been seeking, but happiness. You're so Perhaps right. Perhaps his goal had not been to understand, but to let go. No longer would anyone tell him where to go, what to do, or how to feel. Whatever life he lives, it Whoa. will be his. I feel and like if I do this, I might already just know. end it was the, the game. The only thing worth knowing. Stanley stepped through the open door. I can't really do, do that on here. Stanley felt the cool oh, breeze upon okay. his skin, the feeling of liberation, the immense possibility of the new path before him. This was exactly the way, right now, that things were meant to happen. And Stanley was happy. <laughs> I feel like I did something wrong. I don't know why. I have this like inkling feeling I did something wrong. And I was actually supposed to deviate somewhere. God fuck, I knew it. Okay, so we were supposed to turn it on. Or gone, we're supposed to what could it mean? you know, finally, finally to touch to go on to the grass. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. So We go back, and when we when reach Stanley there, came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his be left. beat it? How do I beat it? I'm fucking stupid, bro. <laughs> I feel like some of you guys forget how Yet stupid I am. there was not a single person here either. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office. Hoping he might find an answer there. Coming to a staircase, Stanley walked upstairs to his okay. boss's office. I don't know why I'm getting scared. I shouldn't be getting scared. This isn't a horror game. Why am I getting scared? Okay, listen, I'm just a pussy, okay? It's fine. Like, there's... Oh! Noth nothing creepy about this. No, nothing what whatsoever. Yeah, yeah. And we'll go down using this, this, this lift instead. Yeah, this one, it's, it's glowing. Like my skin. Why is the narrator, that's what I'm saying. The narrator is just a little bit, kinda, you know. There are no jump scares in this game, right? Right? No way. No jump scares. Hayes agree. <laughs> Is he humming? Oh, I love that. I hope the narrator's single. <laughs> I hope I can romance the, the narrator. <laughs> Is it just not gonna end? Is it gonna keep going? Okay. Okay with that. But uh Where's the narrator up, Cal? You're so right. Hey, Mr. Narrator Man! Uh you interested in strawberry cows? Me, perhaps? Now. Cheating on Hank? You know damn well Hank is my father figure! Hey Cal, hey Vincent, how you doing? Leave my man alone. The narrator? He's not your man. Excuse me. Yeah, suck my cock. Plot said lift never ends? That could be possible, but... 
Why would they do that? Oh, oh, oh shit! Amder! Well, ship 25 months. Let's, let's, oh, huh? Let's go? 25 months, Bog? You're right, it didn't end. Uh, my bad. The moment he entered his manager's office, Stanley froze in his tracks. Not a living soul anywhere. Could he really be all alone? This was too much for Stanley to take. Too much for- Stanley was in such a rush to get through the story <laughs> as quickly as possible, he didn't even have a single minute to just let the narrator talk. I'm sorry, that kind baby! Of anxiety isn't healthy. Sorry! So he relaxed for a few moments with some calming new age music. Oh, fucking damn it. I'm sorry, baby. I should have waited for you to finish talking. I apologize. I feel Being as if you keep telling me things. Forward into the open you fumbled. Passageway. Fine. I have many more chances. 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 You know? You made him angry. He's not a oh, My scopophobia. Okay. <sighs> Sorry. I... If you didn't know what I did, I, I saw, I saw, I saw things. They looked like eyes. I covered my face and I just, I, I screamed internally. I hate that. I hate the feeling of being watched. That's why sometimes when I go to bed, I just don't. I just don't go to bed because I don't want to. I don't want to. I'm being watched. Stanley walked straight ahead through the large door that read Mind Control Facility. Okay. Once more, let's do this. Easy dubs. Easy dubs. Dum. The lights rose on an enormous I hate the feeling of being watched, Twitch streamer. You know what, what I mean. What secret did this place hold? You Stanley know what I mean. Cow's a narrator, did IRL. My narrator's on my own out. fucking brain, okay? I tell myself shit like, cow, cow pisses. Why is it green? Why is your piss green? And I start crying. I now have breakdown. To life. The voices. You're not gonna stop. Each bore the number of an employee <laughs> of the building. Stanley's co-workers. The lives of so many individuals reduced to images on a screen. And Stanley, one of them, eternally monitored in this place where freedom meant nothing. Okay. We got this. And this time... This mind control. We're gonna facility. get through with this. It was too calmly. horrible to believe. It How's your day, Cal? I'm chilling. Had Stanley really been under someone's control all this time? Was this the only reason he was happy with his boring job? That his emotions had been manipulated to accept it blindly? So. No. We turn on the thing. to believe it. He couldn't accept it. And then we it. solve his own it. Life calmly. In someone else's control? Never. It was unthinkable. Wasn't it? Was it even possible? Had he truly spent his entire life utterly blind to the world? But okay. here was the proof. The, pay the heart of the operation. Controls labeled with emotions. Happy or sad or content. Walking, eating, working. All of it monitored There's nothing and on them right from now. this very place. But and as the cold reality of his past began to sink in, Stanley decided that this machinery would never again exert its terrible power over another human life. For he would dismantle the controls once and for all. You're, you're not gonna get mad at me if I press on, right? You're not gonna get mad at me, right? Don't get mad at me. Oh, Stanley, you didn't just activate the controls, did you? After they kept you enslaved all these years, you go and you try to take control of the machine for yourself. Is that what uh. you wanted? Control? Oh, Stanley, I applaud your effort, I really do. But you need to understand, uh. there's only so much that machine can do. Okay, 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 you okay, okay. Not again. We got this, we got this Turn the time. We're smart. Off and leave. We're smart. If you want we got to throw this. my story off track, you're going to have to do much better than that. <laughs> I'm afraid you don't have nearly the power you think you do. For example, and I believe you'll find this pertinent, Stanley suddenly realized he had just initiated the network's emergency detonation system. In the event okay. that this machine is activated without proper DNA identification, 
nuclear detonators are set to explode, eliminating the entire okay. complex. Okay, that's okay. How long until detonation then? Mm, let's say um, two minutes. Ah, now this is making things a little more fun, isn't it, Stanley? It's your time to we shine. We need to find the, the blue star. button with the three. It's your story now. Shape it to your That's heart's a house. desires. Oh, blue this is button with much three. better than what I had in mind. What a shame we have so little time left to enjoy it. Blue, Mere moments blue until three. the bomb goes off. But what the precious blues are all houses. More time to talk about you, about me, where we're going. R Red? What all this means. I barely know where Red. to start. What's that? You'd like to know where your co-workers are. A moment of solace before you're obliterated. Red. All yeah. right, I'm in a good mood. You're gonna die anyway. I'll tell you exactly what happened to them. I erased them. Red. I turned oh. off the machine. I set you what? free. Of course, that was merely in this instance of the story. Huh? Sometimes when I tell it, okay. I simply let you Five. sit there in your office forever, pushing buttons endlessly and then dying alone. One. Other times, I let the office sink into the ground, swallowing Two. everyone inside, or I let it burn to a crisp. I have to say this, though. This version of events has been rather amusing. Watching you try to make sense of everything and take back the control Three. wrested away from you, it's quite rich. I almost hate to see it Four. go. But I'm sure whatever I come up with on the next go around will be even better. My goodness, only 34 Five. seconds left. But I'm enjoying this so much. You know what? To hell with what? it. I'm going to put some extra time on the clock. Why not? Five. I did it. These are precious additional seconds, Stanley. Time doesn't grow on trees. Hint oh, green dear me, too? What's the matter, Stanley? Is it that you have no idea where you're going or what you're supposed to be doing right now? Or did you just assume when you saw that timer that something in this room was capable of turning it off? I mean, look at you. Okay, no, no. Running no. from button to button, screen to screen, what? clicking on every little thing huh? in this room. These One? numbered buttons. What? No, these colored huh? ones. Or maybe this big red One? button. Or this door. Two? Everything, anything, something here will save me. Why and are we sorry? That, Stanley, that this video game can be beaten? One solved? Do you have any idea what your purpose in this place is? What? I don't know. Oh my god, Stanley, but right? You really Bird? Bro, an your own stupidity will let you hear. I'm you trying! Looking desperately for a solution. Ten? A hundred? A thousand? I look forward to finding out and to watching the bomb go off each huh? time you fail. Or just you and me and the wretched. You need to push the buttons in order. Am I not over doing and that? Over and over for all of eternity. And Stanley died again. And Stanley Am I not doing died that? Again. Huh? Stanley died again. Huh? Take a look at the clock, huh? Stanley. That's 30 seconds. Okay, okay, okay. Again? Let's try again. What game is this? This is Stanley's parable. I am... I am fucking stupid. Okay. What if I just sit here and do my work? You know, like a normal person. All of this code order of the gone. color. What do you what mean, order mean? of the colors? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. There's a Perhaps voice in my head, and it's not minute. my own, and I don't, and I don't like it. What do you mean, order of the color? Just try not listening to him at all. Okay, but when I do that, he gets mad at me, and I don't like it when he gets mad at me. I feel upset. When Stanley came to a set of I think it matters if you doors, fail in this. He entered the door on his left. No, no, I, I did I did fail and I died and I reset from the beginning. Which I don't want to happen again. Maybe we go escape this time. Yet there was not a single person here either. Feeling a wave of disbelief. I'll keep going. Stanley oh, really? decided yeah. to go up to his boss's yeah. office. Coming to a staircase, Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's office. Okay. You need to put her in the right order of the color, I mean. Okay, I think we all know the drill. What does that now. mean? Blah, 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 dark secrets, the keypad. Stanley pushes some buttons. Oh, hey, look, it's a new passageway. Kill surprise. I was gonna wait for you, bitch! I was gonna be good and I was gonna wait for you, but oh no, no. Oh, Stanley pressed the buttons. What if I didn't press the buttons, huh? What if that's what I, not what I wanted to do? Hmm? What would you do then? Cry? 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 Cry?
Shut up. Eat my ass. Stanley walked straight ahead through the large door that read Mind Control Facility. Should we escape? <sighs> I'm kind of scared of the escape path, though. It looks scary. No, I don't think. <laughs> God damn it. Uh... Go in there. We're going where? There's two things. There's two places I can go to. One of them, we know, leads to the place. And the place, the place kills us. Okay? Bad. You left without saying it back. I messed up. And it's hi cow. Hi bunny. Escape. Escapid. Okay, let's go escapid. Ra. Although this passageway had the word escape written on it, the truth was that at the end of this hall, Stanley would meet his violent death. What? No, I won't. Why? The door behind him was not shut. Stanley still had every opportunity to I don't to think I can go watch cow cows. It's so track. important. <laughs> At this point, Stanley was making a going? conscious, Dude, I'm concerted effort stupid, to walk forward and willingly confront I think his I'm death. stupid. Yeah. Hello. Am I gonna die? Whee! Oh, I didn't die. Huh? As the machine whirred into motion huh? and Stanley was inched Wait. closer and closer to oh, his eyes, dying. he reflected that his life had been of no consequence whatsoever. Uh, Stanley no, can't see the bigger picture. He doesn't huh? know the real story. Huh? Trapped huh? forever in his huh? narrow vision huh? of huh? what this world is. Huh? Perhaps his death was of no great loss, like plucking the eyeballs before I die. Man. And so he resigned uh. and willingly accepted this violent end to his brief and shallow life. Farewell, Stanley. If we make it through fast enough. Oh, okay. Goodbye. Oh. Farewell, Stanley, cried the narrator, as Stanley was led helplessly into the, the enormous the fuck are you? jaws. In a single visceral instant, Who are you? Stanley was obliterated as the machine crushed you're not, every bone in his body. You're not the killing same. Him instantly. Oh. The Stanley Parable. And yet it would be just a few minutes before Stanley would restart the game back in his office as alive no. as ever. Thank you for the fall asleep, Amon. Exactly How did you doing? the narrator today? think he was going to accomplish? She sounds so... Mm. She sounds old. When every path you can walk has been created for you huh? long in advance, death becomes meaningless, huh? making life the same. Do you see now? Do you see that Stanley was already dead from the moment he hit start? Office layout. I see. Okay, this is interesting. Wait, cow equals cow. Yeah, did you just get that? Yay, freedom! Office computers. Oh, I turned... Oh, I turned that off. Oh, okay, I keep turning everything off. I should voice in... Evo, if you voice a narrator, I would stop playing the game. <laughs> Office clock. That is true. That is the office clock. Is there anything here that I should be interested in? The lounge, the underground. That's not what that looked like. What? What the hell? I'm sorry. Narration outtakes. Keith, Kevin, writing. The voice of the narrator recorded the dialogue for the entire game. Stanley roughly. stood on the snow. Stay here for a bit? Okay. And finally, he pushed the number nine. <laughs> is he gonna, like, start lick licking me? Or, like, is there anything... Stanley walked over the bridge. Okay, I'm just not gonna... Stanley <laughs> Stanley stood on the snow. <laughs> Did you survive as the game ended? No, no, we. I don't think we ended the, the game just yet. I really don't know what's going on. I think we're... Exit. I, 
think there's more here? Yeah, we, we haven't... We haven't been to the- oh wait, no, I think we have. We just didn't stay along enough. Okay. Interesting, interesting. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, and this- WAR ZONE?! The battlefield fighting aliens. The action game will become sentient and would wage war against the na narrator? Oh, okay. Interesting. Not good, actually. Okay, get better. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. And yo, hello, Vision! How you doing today? From Anthony. What is this strange number? Could you tell me the no significance of... The I know this. What would you do if Stanley entered any other rooms? This is some lore shit. We're gonna move voice over barking to what is Stanley's last name? Yelnats. What? <laughs> Damn. Okay, no. We're gonna escape. Right through the exit. And we'll see what happens. <laughs> oh. Mommies? Sorry. Oh, look at these two. How they wish to destroy one another. How they wish to control one another. Two? How they both wish to be free. Oh. Can you see? Can you Lord, see how much that? they need one another? No, I can't. I can't no, see anything. Perhaps not. I can't Sometimes see anything. These Yo! Hold on. Hold on. Dumb? Hello, hello. Welcome, welcome. How are you? Let me give you a shout out. Sorry, I, I really can't pronounce your name. I, I'm so sorry. I'm trying my best. I hope you can tell. But yeah, oh, that's not even... You're okay. Cz is dumb. No, I am dumb. I, I, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. There you go. Wee! Welcome. Just call me dumb, mate. Okay, okay. I didn't even read your name correctly. Damn it. Okay, thank you for the fall, hung humble. We're playing the Stanley Parable. But listen to me. Uh, you oh, can still save again? Them. You can stop the program before they both fail. Huh? Push escape and press quit. There's no other way to beat this game. As long as you move forward, you'll be walking someone else's path. Stop it's okay. Now and be your own I don't mind death. Choice. Thank you for the fall, Dan. Do choose it. Don't let time Goodbye. choose for you. Don't let I'm a long lost follower, Ayo. Okay, I died. Am I gonna come back? And there I am. Where is my narrator? Where is he? Where? All of his characters were gone. What could it mean? Oh, Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps it's been all since I last stopped here. Ah, I see. It's been six months. Mmm. We're playing Gartic Phone. Ah, I see. I see. I see. Can I get through there? Pur pur purple? Just, just the one. Just, just a purplish pink. Is this supposed to mean anything? I, I don't know. You were CFP and GCB at that time? Damn time flows? Yeah, it do be like that. I need majority, I was just wrong on paper. I see, I see. Dude, what? This game confuses me so much. I get it, I get it. I swear this wasn't here last time. This wasn't. Was it? When Stanley came to a set of two open okay. doors, he entered the door and press press exit easy. And we just end the stream right there. Okay. Uh oh. Yet there was not a single person here either. 
Feeling a wave of disbelief, okay. Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office, hoping he might find an answer there. Okay. Go to the right now, well, too late! Coming to a staircase, Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's office. Okay. I know I said no backseating in my stream. Narrator. I was gonna wait Here's for the you. door, just go. I was going to wait for you, darling! I was gonna patiently sit there and go, Mmm, I'm so excited to hear the narrator's voice! <sighs> Whatever. Have you had a good stream? Bye, have a lovely hello. Hello, gender stealer from hell. How you doing? Stanley walked straight ahead through the large door that read Mind Control Facility. I got you, I understand. I will, I, I will do exactly as you say. The narrator's hired the door. Dude, I skipped it once. The lights rose on an enormous room packed with television screens. What horrible secret did this place hold? Stanley thought to himself. Did he have the Oh, oh there I go! Out? Whoa. Uh... Aha! You've made it to the bottom of the mind control facility. Welcome! <laughs> you see, back when the Stanley Parable first launched in 2013, <laughs> getting to the bottom of the mind control facility was a bug that we simply didn't catch during development. Damn! And you all sent us lots of photos of it on Twitter and acted very superior about it. And you're all very, I'm, I'm very sorry! I didn't even know! I didn't even know! When it came time to update the game, we knew that we had to do something about this little goof of ours, so here you go. I, I didn't even know I could do New it! Content. You can call it the bottom of the mind control room. I didn't even know I could do this! Your perception of the value Why are you so content? snappy? Isn't that what you crave? New no! Content? I want to oh, beat the more game! Content, more content, more, no, more, I never more, said more, that! More, more, more. And I'm here to give it to you. Thank you. I'm here to make it <laughs> seem like we really covered every nook and cranny of the game with secrets and Easter eggs. How about this? We wrote a new piece of music just for this section. Yeah. You won't hear it anywhere else in the game. Yeah, what's it it's gonna a be? secret that's just for you. Uh, dude, I do. I literally just found. Okay, listen. We I didn't even this plan track. this to happen. Good job. You've made it to the bottom of the mind control facility. Well done. Good job, you did it. Good job. <clears throat> Three, two, one. Good job, you made it to the bottom of the mind control facility. You jumped on the catwalk. You should have been careful. You should have been careful. It used to be a bug, but now it's an ending. Now it's an ending. I believe in you, I believe in your ability to cross this barrier and chase your dreams. But railings don't mean anything. Good job, you did it, 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 good job, you did it. Are you done? Thank you. <laughs> His face is so unimpressed. I didn't even mean to. I didn't even mean to do it. It's kind of a jam, though. No, I don't think so. I don't think it's a jam. I think it's. He was so snappy for no reason. I didn't Someone even was know that. Stanley. He was sure of it. Stop! Don't do that to me. No one's following me. If he checked over his shoulder now, he would surely catch them. It was only a matter of time. I got baited by the sick monologue, but I'm hooked by the monologue of despair. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> mm. It's okay. I'm smart. Hello, gamers. How's everyone when doing? Stanley I'm came to a set of two open stupid. doors. He entered the door on his left. I entered the door on my left. Let's go, friends. I'm so excited. Yippee! I can't wait to go through this entire thing over and over and Yet, over again. There was not a single person here either. 
feeling a wave of disbelief. This is so Stanley fun! To go I'm enjoying myself. Off, I'm to enjoying yourself, Chad. Stanley I'm enjoying yourself. To his boss's office. <laughs> the voice is a trap. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's go to work. Yeah, 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 yeah. Shut up, shut up. But you, you were so pissy about me. Just, I didn't even know it was a feature. God damn. The voice is so different. Oh, you know what they say? You gotta have something up your sleeves. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Scary, scary. Ooh, big mind control facility door. Stanley walked Whoa! straight through the large door that read Mind Control Facility. I'm not gonna fall off this time. The lights rose on an enormous room packed with television. Oh, well, powerful voices, what my dude. Thank you. This place Good thing I'm sleeveless. What the hell does that himself. mean? Did he have the strength to find out? Huh? So look at that out of pocket voice change. <laughs> now the Don't fall, you can't get up. Yeah, yeah, I Each bore yeah, the number of an employee in the building. Stanley's co-workers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The lives da, da, da. of so many individuals diam anjir, on a screen. Yeah, 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 yeah. One of them, yeah, uda, yeah, da, da. monitored in this place. Enough, baby. Uda, cukup, cukup. Nothing. Diam bacot. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, let's go. This mind control. You said you should. Oh, I see. It was too horrible to believe. It I don't remember be things I say. Had Stanley really been under someone's control all this time? Was this the only reason he was happy with his boring job? That his emotions had been manipulated to accept it <laughs> yes. finally? No. He refused to believe it. He couldn't accept it. His own life in someone else's control? Never. Never. It was unthinkable. Wasn't it? Was it even possible? Yeah. Had he truly spent his entire yeah. life utterly blind to the world? Okay. Okay, and please stop calling me out. Proof. The heart of the he, where's my free candy? Did I ever? Emotions. Happy or sad or content? I don't want to touch it. Walking, them. eating, working, all of it monitored and commanded from this very place. And as okay. the cold reality of his past began to sink in, Stanley decided that this machinery would never again exert its terrible power over another human life. So how do we beat this part of the game? <laughs> I'm just asking, how the fuck do we beat this, huh? For he would dismantle the controls once I don't understand. And press for on. All. Yeah, we press on. Oh, Stanley, you didn't just activate. We the press control, on, and then what Not do we do? Kept you I don't understand it. And you try to take control. Turn it on. It, okay, I turned it on. Is that what you wanted? Just finish control. it. I don't know how to do that. Oh, Stanley. I applaud your effort, I really do. But you need to understand, there's only so much that yeah, machine can yeah, do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You were supposed to let it go, turn the controls off, and leave. I got you. If you want to throw my story off track, you're going to have to do much better than that. I'm afraid you don't have nearly the power you think you do. For mm -hmm. example, yeah. and I believe you'll find this pertinent. Pertinent. Stanley suddenly realized he had just initiated the network's emergency detonation system. In the event that this machine is activated without proper DNA identification, nuclear detonators are said to explode, eliminating the entire complex. How long until detonation then? Mm, let's say um, two minutes. Ah, now this is making things. A How do we beat this? <laughs> Tell me now, please. I'm fucking stupid. Little more fun, isn't it, Stanley? It's your time to shine. Incorrect. You are the okay, star. cool. It's uh, your story three. now. Shape it to your heart's desire. Is that oh, this is right? much better than what I had in mind. What a shame we have so little yeah. time left to enjoy it. Mere moments until the bomb goes off. But what precious moments each one of them is. More time to talk about you, about me, where we're going. Oh wait, what all this wait! Means. I barely know oh, where to start. oh, oh! I get Listen. it. You'd like to know where your co-workers are. A moment of solace before you're obliterated. That's a four. Oh, I get it. Dude, you're gonna die. Oh! Anyway. I'll tell you exactly what happened to them. I erased them. I turned off the machine. Three. I set you free. Of course, Th three? that was merely in this instance of the story. Sometimes when I tell it, I three. simply let you sit there three. in your office forever, pushing buttons endlessly and then dying alone. Three? 
Other times, I let the office sink into the ground, swallowing everyone inside, or I let it burn to a crisp. I have to say this, though. This version of events has been rather amusing. Watching you try to make sense of everything and take back the control wrested away from you, it's quite huh? rich. I almost hate Please to you see don't be go. This. But I'm sure whatever I come One, up with on the next and then we go press around the two. will be even better. My right? goodness, only 34 <laughs> seconds left. But I'm enjoying this so much. You know what? To hell with it. I'm going to put some extra time on the clock. Why not? These are precious additional seconds, Stanley. Time doesn't Purple grow four? Oh, That's dear a four? Me, what's the matter, Stanley? Is it that you have no idea where you're going or what yes. you're supposed to be doing right now? Or did you just assume when you saw that timer that something in this room was capable of turning it off? I mean, oh, 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 terrible sound. Wait, wait, screen, I, get I get it, I get it, I get it. Little thing in this room. I get it. Thank you for the follow, Yuda. Oh, Highly appreciate these it. Colored ones, or maybe this big red button, or this door. Everything, One, anything, something here two, will save me. Why would you think that, Stanley? Okay, okay, okay. That this video game can be beaten. Three, 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 three. One solved. Solved. Do you have any three, idea what your purpose four? in this place is? Yeah, Ayo hey, Stanley Parable. But yeah, 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 really yeah, yeah. There's an answer. I'm correct. How many times will you replay this bit, looking desperately for a solution? Shut up. Ten, a hundred, a thousand. I look forward four, to four and then five. And to watching right? the bomb go off right? each time you fail. Right? Just you and me and the wretching explosion of fire and metal over and over and over for all of eternity. And Stanley died again. And Stanley died again. And Stanley died again. Is that right? Five? Take a look at the clock, Stanley. That's 30 seconds you have left to struggle. 30 seconds until a big boom and then nothing. Huh? No Mabel? Backup power to Where is that? Oh fuck, okay. Uh or will you let it go peacefully? Another choice. Make it count. Or death. That's not the right one. Yes, me think. Oh, I'm doing this. And believe me, I will be laughing at every second of your inevitable life from the moment we fade in until the moment I What the hell? Damn it! What did I do wrong? What did I do wrong? Tell me, oh, don't owe me. What did I do wrong? Huh? Maybe stopping the- All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? He guided Stanley you. Stanley decided to I'm go to the meeting room. Myself. Perhaps you pissed him off? I'm Nana. gonna piss myself. Hmm? F? Don't F me. Tell me how to do this game. God fucking damn it. The others. Calm. If we just when breathe. Stanley came to a set of two open doors, okay. he entered the door oh, on his God. left. Endless loop. No, we're okay. We got this. We Yet got this. There was not a single Your can't turn under. it off. Feeling a wave I of disbelief. Disagree. Stanley decided to go up I to say his boss's office. I can to turn a it off. Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's office. Ooh. Stanley walked to his boss's office. Oh, here's, the, here's door. the door. Oh, how many times are you gonna keep replying this? Shut up, Sans. I've seen this in Undertale, and I've played that for 70 hours. Is this what it feels like to work in corporate? <laughs> Actually. <laughs> Yeah, Stanley walked straight yeah. ahead through the large door that read Mind yeah. Control Facility. You're not gonna skip this part for me? You're just gonna force me to press the button every single time? Is the that lights so? rose on huh? an enormous room packed with television screens. Hello, hello, Aiden. How are you what doing today? Hope you're, you're doing good. Place <gasps> Wait, you're a strawberry. Stanley turn it off. Himself. I turned it Did off, and I escaped to the outside world. Out. Listen, I don't want to escape to the outside world. I want to beat this game. Or I could escape and now turn around. To life. Let's hear me. She was right. Hey, yo. Welcome, welcome. What's up? Yeah, no, I'm a... Building. I'm your new entertainer face. now. The lives of so many individuals <laughs> reduced to Muru. images on a screen. And thank you for the follow, Muru. I highly appreciate it. Them, eternally monitored in this place. Where You're doing good. What about you and chat? I'm chilling. I'm pissed at this game. Uh, chat, type a one if you're feeling good. Type this a two if you're pissing facility. yourself. It was too horrible have you wanted the broom called? I have not. Be true. Had Stanley really been under someone's control all this time? 
Was this the only reason he was happy with yeah. his boring job? But that something stopped inside of me. I didn't care. I didn't care about being a super saiyan. Finally. What? Huh? Two? No. Okay. He refused to believe it. Okay, he no. couldn't we got accept this. it. His One, own two, life seven, three, twelve. That, those are all not numbers that I told you to Never. say. Okay. It was unthinkable. Three. I enjoy your Wasn't anguish. It? Fuck you. Was it even possible? Had he truly spent his entire life utterly blind to the world? So I turn it off, the roof, the heart and then the after operation. I turn it off, I turn Controls around. Controls labeled with emotions, happy or sad, Ready to get or content. Harizd? All of it monitored and commanded from this very place. And as the cold reality of his past began to sink in, Stanley decided that this machinery would never again exert its terrible power over another human life. Okay, 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 okay. We turn it off. We turn it off. We get to see the sky. We get to see the sky. We turn around. Blackness. And yeah. a rising chill. Are you of an ice cream cone? Because I want. Was it over? No, I'm not an ice cream cone. Yes. <laughs> he had won. Okay. He had okay. defeated the machine. Unshackled himself from someone else's. No, command. no. Okay, Freedom no. Freedom was mere moments away. I'm pretty sure they were joking, yet, Andrew. It's okay. Even as the immense door slowly opened. Stanley reflected on how many puzzles still lay unsolved. Where had his co-workers gone? How had he been freed from the machine? Can I not glass? go back? What other mysteries did this strange building hold? Can I not go back? But as sunlight streamed into the chamber, he realized oh my God. none of this mattered XD. to him. <laughs> yeah. For it was not knowledge mm. or even... Uh, by the way, I do prefer you guys not making those kind of jokes at me, but, power you know, I... can seeking. But happiness. I admit, Perhaps his goal I did had not ask to be raised. But, to let but just don't do it again. <laughs> no longer would anyone tell him where to go. My fault, what you know? To do, or how to feel. Whatever life he lives, it will be his. And that was all he needed to know. It was perhaps the only thing worth knowing. Stanley stepped. Riz is Vanable here, door. first time. No, it's. It's sexual, Riz. Uh, if it's non-sexual, it's fine. I'm gonna just begin the game again. Not the codic ending. What's the codic ending? Okay, we got this. We got this. All of his co-workers were gone. What, what could, could it mean? mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps, Perhaps he, had he had simply, simply missed, missed the memo. memo. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. What happens if we, like, go downstairs? Yet there was not a single person <laughs> Can't get bad for because I got none. Feeling Damn. a wave of disbelief, or maybe we should Stanley wait, decided you know? To go up to his the narrator's voice is... Office. No, Hoping that's a thing the narrator's voice there. is. But, like, the narrator himself, bit annoying. Okay. Why is narrator cow British? The narrator itself is British. Coming to a staircase, Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's office. Yeah, fuck you, bitch. How do you feel about them apples? Hmm? But Stanley just couldn't do it. He considered the possibility of facing his boss. Admitting he had left his post during work hours, he might be fired for that. And in such a competitive economy, uh, why had he taken that risk? So scary. All because he believed everyone had vanished. His boss would think he was crazy. And then something occurred to Stanley. Maybe, huh? he thought to himself, maybe I am huh? crazy. All of my co-workers blinking mysteriously out of existence in a single moment for no reason huh? at all. None of it made any logical sense. Huh? And as Stanley pondered this, he began to make other strange observations. For example, why couldn't he see his feet when he looked down? Oh shit, why can't why I see my feet? Why doors close automatically behind him wherever he went? And for that matter, these rooms were starting to look yeah. pretty familiar. Uh, were they simply repeating? Huh. No, Stanley said to himself, this is all too strange, this can't be real. And at last, he came to the conclusion that had been on the tip of his tongue. He just hadn't found the words for it. 
I'm dreaming, he yelled. This is all a dream. I hear things. Oh, what a relief Stanley felt to have finally found an answer, an explanation. Yeah. His co-workers weren't actually gone. He wasn't going to lose his job. He wasn't crazy after all. And he thought to himself, I suppose I'll wake up soon. I suppose I will. I go back to my boring real life job pushing buttons. This is so terrifying for well no reason. I this while I'm still lucid. So, he imagined himself flying and began to gently float above oh, the ground. Oh, oh, oh. Then he imagined himself soaring what? through space oh. on a magical star field. And it too appeared. It was so oh. much fun. Huh? And Stanley marveled that he had still not woken up. Huh? How was he remaining so lucid? And then perhaps the strangest question of them all entered Stanley's head. One he was amazed he hadn't asked himself sooner. Yeah? Why is there a voice in my head dictating mm -hmm. everything that I'm doing and thinking? Now the voice was describing itself being considered by Stanley, who found it particularly strange. Yeah? I'm dreaming about a voice describing me Thinking about how it's describing my thoughts, he thought. Is this an ending? And while he thought it all very no odd, and, and wondered redeemed? if this voice the... looked to all Oh my god, dreams, they've been paused. The was that of course, Someone should unpause them. This was not a dream. Cow, hi, Hara. Could it be? Was Stanley I'm simply deceiving himself? So confused. Himself, believing that if he's asleep, he doesn't have to take responsibility Can for I be... Himself? Do I have to remember those? Stanley is One, two, B4. Right now, Are those important? Has he's ever been in his life. Now hearing the voice speak these words was quite a shock to Stanley. After all, I can't he knew for certain see, beyond I'm a doubt short. that this was in fact a dream. Did the voice not see him float and Whoa. make the magical stars just a moment ago? How else would the voice explain all that? This voice was a part of himself too. Surely, surely, if he could just... Yeah. He would prove it. He would prove that he was in control. That this was a dream. Check the M's in a so bit. So he closed his eyes gently and oh. he invited himself to wake huh? up. He felt the cool weight of the blanket what? on his skin, the pulse huh? of the mattress on his back, the fresh air of a world outside this one. Huh? I'm Let so confused. Thank you for the head pad. Highly appreciate it. I'm. I'm through with this dream. Confusion. I wish it to be over. Let me so this is what insanity and overthinking feels Let like. Let me continue yeah. pushing the buttons, please. It's all I want. That's not what I. I want my apartment, and my wife, and my job. All I want is my life exactly the way it's always been. Wake up, cow! Your family misses you. Shut my up. My <laughs> is normal. I am normal. I. This is not Everything very normal. Will be fine. I am okay. Cow, he responds. I know. I know. I saw. Oh. Uh. Stanley began screaming. Oh, please, someone oh, wake okay, me up. My okay. name is Stanley. Huh? I have a boss. I have an office. Huh? I am real. Please, just someone tell me. Why is the screen turning real. red? I must be real. I must Why be is the screen turning red? Voice? Who am I? Who am I? Why is this? And everything went black. Why is? Oh, okay. I've got another response. Well, she, okay. Jeez. This is the story. I am of a so woman confused. Named Insanity. I am going insane, actually. Mariella woke up. Mariella! She arose, got dressed, gathered her belongings, and walked to her oh, place. Uh, uh, but on this particular day, her walk was interrupted by the body of a man <laughs> Is that who had me? stumbled through town talking and screaming to himself, and then collapsed dead on the sidewalk. Oh. And although she would soon turn oh. to go call for an ambulance, huh? for just a few brief moments, she considered the strange. <gasps> Are we getting married? He was obviously crazy. This much she knew. My favorite Everyone back character. We're getting married. Look like. No way. And in that moment, she thought to herself how lucky she was to be normal. We're getting married, chat. I am saying, I am in control of my mind. I know that what insanity is real and what isn't. <laughs> it was comforting to think this, and in a certain way, seeing this man made her feel. Oh better. man, she's gonna want to marry me now. Remember the meeting she had. Think you're gonna fall cheer. I really appreciate. It. Are we invited? The you're all invited. People whose impressions of her would affect her career, and by extension, the rest of her life. Wow. She had no time for this, so it was only a moment that she stood there, and then I woke up, and I body. went... <sighs> and then she turned and ran. Did I die and go to heaven? Because you're an angel. Or not. Okay, I, I lied. <laughs> 
okay. I, I, I didn't want to get married anyways. It's not, it's not like I'm lonely forever. No, it's okay. No, I'm okay with this. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All of his co-workers were gone. Mario mean? really finds a dude passed out in the street and goes, to damn, go to the anyway. Room. Perhaps he has simply <laughs> missed a memo. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. <laughs> Mary all relatable queen, actually. Yet there was not a single person here either. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley decided to go up to his boss's. Coming to a staircase, Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's office. Are you gonna. Yeah. Here's the door, just go. Yeah. Broom closet? No thanks. I just want to get this done with. I'm done with this. I immediately recognize the intensity ending. If a bucket with you, it gives you a different ending. What bucket? There's a bucket you can get? Okay. Dude, I am Stanley walked straight ahead through the large door I'm of the insane. red mind control facility. Okay. So far we've gotten like three endings. I mean, the lights rose on an enormous room packed good, with good television enough. screens. What horrible secret did this place hold? Stanley thought bucket. to himself. What's the bucket? Did he have the strength to find out? Now the monitors jumped to life, their true nature revealed. Each bore the number of an employee in the building, Stanley's co-workers. The lives okay, of so bucket? many yeah, individuals reduced saying. to images on a screen. A bucket? And Stanley, one of them, eternally monitored in this place where freedom meant nothing. Okay. This mind control facility, it was too horrible to believe. It couldn't be true. Had Stanley really been under My brother just closed the door time? in the was room the beside me. He was happy with his boring and I am mentally ill. I got scared. had been manipulated to accept it blindly. No. He <laughs> refused to believe it. He couldn't accept it. His own life in someone else's control? Never. It was unthinkable. Wasn't it? Was it even possible? Had he truly spent his entire uh, life utterly blind to the world? You. But here was the proof, the stupid. heart of the operation. Controls labeled with emotions. Happy, or sad, One. or content. Walking, Two. eating, working. All of it monitored and commanded from this yeah. very place. And as the cold reality of his past Three. began to sink in, Three. Stanley decided that this machinery four. would never again exert its terrible power over another human life. No four. For he would okay. dismantle the controls once and for all. Interesting. Okay. So, we go straight ahead, we turn it on, we click all the buttons, and then what? Stanley, you didn't just activate okay, okay, the controls, okay. got did you? Got you? Got After got they this. kept you enslaved Easy. all these years, you go and you try to take control mm -hmm. of the machine for yourself. Is that what you wanted? Control? Oh, Stanley, I applaud your effort, I really do. But you need to understand, there's only so much that machine can do. You were supposed to let it go, turn the controls off, and leave. If you want to throw my story off track, you're going to have to do like much this better than that. Door open I'm last afraid time. you don't have nearly the power you think you do. For example, and I believe you'll find, find this pertinent. pertinent. Stanley suddenly realized he had Thank just the initiated the network's emergency detonation system. In the event that this machine is activated without proper DNA identification, bom, 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 bom. nuclear detonators are set to explode, bom, 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 eliminating the entire complex. Bom, 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 bom. How long until detonation then? Hmm, let's say, um, two minutes. Ah, now this is making things a little more fun, isn't it, Stanley? It's your time to shine. You are the star. It's your story now. Shape it to your heart's desires. One, oh, this is much two, better than what I had in mind. What a shame we have so little time left to enjoy it. 
Mere moments until the bomb goes off. But what precious Three. moments each one of them is. More time to talk about you. Yeah. About Detonate me. this. Where we're going. <laughs> what all this means. I barely know. Ah, where the illusion of choice. Shut up, man. I'm trying. What's that? Four. You'd like to know where your co workers are. Five. A moment of solace before you're obliterated. Alright, I'm in a good mood. You're gonna die anyway. I'll tell you exactly what happened to them. I erased them. I turned off the machine. I set you free. Of course, that was merely in this Five. instance of the story. Sometimes when I tell it, I simply let you sit there in your office forever, pushing buttons endlessly and then dying alone. Other times, I let the office sink into the ground, swallowing everyone inside, or I let it burn to Oh, uh, you're trying your best? I am trying my best. What do we do here? I don't understand what we're supposed to do here. How do we beat this part? Yes. I have to say this, though. This version of events has been rather amusing. Watching you try to make sense of everything and take back the control Not wrested die. away from you, it's quite And rich. how do I do that? I almost hate to see it go. But I'm sure whatever I come up with on the next go around will be even better. My goodness, only 34 seconds left. But I'm enjoying this huh? so much. You know what? To hell with it. Uh. I'm going to put some extra time on the clock. Why not? These are precious additional seconds, Stanley. Time doesn't grow on trees. Oh? Oh dear me, what's the matter, Stanley? Is it that you have no idea where you're going or what you're supposed to be doing right now? Or did you just assume when you saw that timer that something huh? in this room was capable of turning Any it on? No, there's not. My boy's getting killed. I am getting from killed. button to button. Screen to screen, clicking on every little thing in this room. These numbered buttons. No, these colored ones. Or maybe this big red button. Or this door. Everything, anything. Something here will save me. Why would you say that, Stanley? That this video game can be beaten? One solved? Do you have any idea what your purpose in this place is? But you really believe there's an answer? How many times will you replay this bit, looking desperately for a solution? Ten? A hundred? Where's the thousand? backup power? I look forward to finding out and to watching the bomb go off each time you fail. Just you and me and the wretching explosion of fire and metal over and over and over for all of it. What's the console? And Stanley died again. Did it narrow something up pretty well? And Stanley died again. And Stanley died again. Take a look at the Okay, okay. Again, again, again. Am I stupid? Cause I feel like I am. All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? <laughs> Are you not gonna to tell to me the how to room. beat Perhaps the game? Simply missed a memo. You're not? Do people do this? For hey Kalka, how's it going? Stanley not very came well. To a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Left, straight through. Yet there was not a single power person room? here either. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley decided to go Where's up the to his facility boss's power office, room? hoping he might find an answer there. Room closet. Stanley stepped into the broom closet, but there was nothing here, so he turned around and got back on track. Well, I'm in the broom closet. I don't really know. I looked it up. You want to tell me the new solution? Yes! Stanley walked Thank you for a head pass. Room closet. What? Uh, <laughs> I guess I just forgot how? Yeah. Yes, David, I feel so dumb. I don't want. I don't hear it. I also don't hear it. I don't know what the narrative. I've been listening! And I clicked. I clicked on the option that lets me out of the the area but i don't want to get out of the area i want to stay within the area so i can go to different parts of the game go back to the broom closet i can't go back to the broom closet whoops nope uh, never mind stanley actually got back into the elevator no 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 i want back down i want back down i want back down i want back Why down did stanley do that when he knew that it would just lead back to his boss's office well that's I, I, a I, great I, question i just can't wait to find out <laughs> Back down, 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 back down. What? This is new. 
Here we are, Stanley. It's your boss's office. Exactly the way it was before you got onto the elevator. It's still just exactly what it is. What a decision you've made to come up here and look at the office again. This has fleshed out the plot of the story in new and fascinating ways ah! I could have never anticipated. There's no it's buttons. You cannot stop the bun from going off. Have. What the An fuck? Rapid fire of critical plot points, one after the other, weaving a rich tapestry of uncompromising narrative. Wow. <laughs> I'm bolted to the edge of my seat. Two, eight, four, five. One, two, three, four. Two, zero, sixty nine. Four, twenty, hundred. Did the two eight four is it eight 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 eight? You're right. You're oh fuck. Eight eight eight. Eight 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 eight. Okay. Zero, 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 zero. Maybe it's the year the boss was born, you know? Like, one, zero, two, three. Fuck. One, one, two, eight, four. Sixty-nine? Sixty-nine. Boob. Eight, zero. Zero, eight. Oh, got it. Four, three, two, one. What the fuck do I do? <laughs> again, again, again. Am I stupid? Not really anything to do with stream, but you look like a character that could be in B and Puppy Cat. Oh, that's so nice. All of his co workers were gone. What could it be? Let me in! Let me in! Are you really just doing this for the achievement? Click a door five times. Is that all that you think an achievement is worth? No, 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 no. I can't just give these merits away for such little effort. A measly five clicks. Now suppose you were to click the door 20 times. I would say that's the kind of effort that warrants recognition. I swear this is more than 20 times. This is not- are there any hints at the office? Ooh, that was something else before. It was something with something. <laughs> Who farted? Good to know. 4.30- oh, specifically 4.30. Hmm. I have to say, I'm still not feeling the satisfaction of witnessing true- Watch me go. Watch me go. Perhaps 50 clicks will do it. Yes. I can- I can click it 50, 50 times. <laughs> I am quite click fast at clicking. No, no, I'm, I'm still not feeling it. I, yeah? I want this achievement to have meant yeah? something. It has to be a, a true reward yeah, I used to for play Bed Wars. <laughs> I want to see some hustle, Stanley. I want to see commitment. A willingness yeah? to go all the way, no matter what the Keyboard cost. Crunch. Why don't you go put 20 clicks into door number 417? Where's door 417? 420. Okay. Four, one, seven. Oh, great. Now, go click a few times on door 437. 437. I can't get back through. I, I can't get back through. Oh. Well, that upsets me. Significantly. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he locked us. He, he fucking locked me head. out. A bitch. I'm gonna eat his nipples. Then what's he gonna do? Huh? Nothing. Yet there was not a <laughs> now single you're person here either. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley Perhaps decided to go up to his project. boss's office, hoping he might find an answer there. XO, 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 gossip girl. I am pissed. I am 
no more nip Coming to a staircase, Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's office. Executive bathroom. To be rich! Is it a crime? To commit crimes, isn't it rich? What a life it will be to have to pick just one. Interesting. Extreme bathrooms. Ime. I can't see myself in the mirror. Interesting. Can I use this? No, I cannot. Okay. Not rich enough. I don't like it here. Here's the door. Just go. Yeah, yeah, I know. So if we go down and we press quit that time, Stanley Vampire confirmed, actually, if we press quit this time, I think we can do it. I'm just saying, you know, it could be possible. It could be possible. Stanley walked straight ahead through the large door that read Mind Control Goodbye. Facility. Although this passageway had the word escape written on it, the truth was Just that at the end of this hall, and breathing, Stanley would meet his violent breathing death. And breathing and I don't remember the rest of the lyrics. The math do the be door math behind exactly. him was not shut. Stanley still had every opportunity to turn around and get back on track. Uh -huh. At this point, Stanley was making a conscious, concerted effort to walk forward and willingly confront his death. Yeah, see, so you get it. Whoop. There I go. And then I survive. And then I quit the game. And then I replay the game and see if anything else is different. As the machine whirred into motion and Stanley was inched closer and closer to his demise, he reflected Ooh. that his life had been We get no to hear the lady again. Whatsoever. Stanley can't see the bigger <laughs> picture. He doesn't know the real story, trapped forever in his narrow vision of what this world is. Perhaps Ooh. his death was of no great loss, yeah? like plucking the eyeballs from a blind man. And so he resigned and willingly accepted this violent end to his brief and shallow life. Farewell, Stanley. Goodbye. Excited to see the lady again. She's very nice to me last time. Yeah? Farewell, Stanley. Favorite video narrator, game? Good as question. Stanley was led helplessly into the enormous metal jaws. In a single visceral instant, in a single Stanley visceral was instant. obliterated Stanley as the machine was obliterated. crushed every bone in his body, killing him. What instantly. if I peed myself? And yet it would be just a few minutes before Stanley would restart the game back in his office as alive as ever. What exactly did the narrator think he was going to accomplish? When every path you can walk has been created for you long in advance, death becomes meaningless, making life the same. Do you see now? Do you see that Stanley was already dead from the moment he hit start? Maybe there's something in here. No. People actually named the voice, uh, the curator. Basically, the whole Stanley Parable fandom agreed on that name for her. Well, really? That's interesting. We've been there. We've been here. Uh, uh, count down desk. Freedom ending. Countdown room. Oh, that was the place we were at. I still don't recognize that place. Stanley's office. Interesting. Many versions. The office, okay. The cargo lift? 
I don't like the noise that I'm hearing. The zending lovers? Huh? Okay. Interesting. What does the text say? Text with small mobile? Bro, I, I, I don't know, man. Trailers. I feel like there's something more here. What? I don't know. Okay. To the lounge. Back. Two options. Huh? Vent. One up. Huh? I feel like the solution is here. I also feel like the solution is here. Somewhere. Do I know where? No. Huh? What? Okay. Go back to the boards for a second. I will go back to the boards. There's nothing- I think that's like the developers trying to find out what they can do with the game. Dude, I am- Ugh, Chat! Be for real with me. Type out one of you think I'm stupid. <laughs> Wait, that didn't work- that- why did that work? 75. Ooh, I see, see. I think I'm stupid. I'm missing <laughs> something. Oh, look at these two. How 27. they wish okay. to destroy one another. How they wish to control one another. How they both wish to be free. If I click that. Can you see? Can when you she see tells me how much they need one another. No. That I need to. Not. Sometimes quit the game. these things cannot I'll be do seen. That. But listen to me. You can still save those two. You can stop the program before they both fail. Yeah. Push escape and press quit. Escape and quit. And if I start the game again, what happens? What happens? This is the story of a man named... Huh? All his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Stanley went around touching every little thing in the office, What's but this? it didn't make a oh please. Are you really just doing this for the achievement? Yeah, Click nothing. a door five times. Is that all that you think an achievement is worth? No, 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 no. I can't just give these merits say? away for such little effort. A measly five clicks. Now suppose you were to click the door twenty times. Bitch, I would okay, say no, I'm that's the kind of effort. When you do disobey the narrator, which I have done many times, it's just not working. Cause cause I'm stupid. Oh? I'm still not feeling the satisfaction of witnessing true effort for a noble cause. Perhaps 50 clicks will do it. Yes, okay. almost 50 certainly. clicks. 50 clicks. No, no, I'm, I'm still mm -hmm. not feeling it. I, I want this achievement to have meant something. It has to be a, a true reward for valiant effort. I want to see some hustle, Stanley. I want to see commitment, a willingness to go all the way, uh. no matter what the cost. Why don't you go put pretty <coughs> clicks into door number 417? Have you unplugged the phone? Uh, I don't think you can... Can you do that? I don't think you can do that. No closey dory. No closey dory. Oh. Great. Now, go click a few times on door 437. Okay. Back we go to door 437. 
Hello. Excellent. I think we're getting somewhere. Yeah. Now, door 415. Let's give it ten clicks or so. Okay, let's go. No door, closey goesy. It's like a place out of the box in the weird lift. Ah, oh, I see. Now, back to door number 437. Okay, back we go. Okay. We got this. No, we got this. It's easy. It's easy, Chad. Gamer. Let's see. How about you click on, well, I don't know, the copy machine. All right. Back to room 417. I'm really feeling it now. I think we're getting somewhere. I don't know when this is going to end, but it's the only thing I know how to do correctly, so I'm going to keep doing it until it praises me or something. Okay. Now go climb on employee 419's desk. How do you climb on a desk? Yes! This is great! You're putting it all on the line, Stanley. I like that. All right, let's keep it up. Go give me a few clicks on door 416. Back out we go. We've almost got it! Yeah? Now the copy machine. Do that one again! Yeah? Yeah? Finish it off, Stanley! Yeah. Five clicks on door 430! Hello, hello, Yes! We did yeah. it! Oh, wow. That yeah? felt amazing. Yeah? Oh, you really earned it, Stanley. Nothing yeah? could hold you back. Yes, I'm very proud of how far we've yeah. come today. Just think, only a few minutes ago, you believed an achievement was worth five little clicks. Really, now? What were you Thank you for the headband, by the way. And, yeah. Okay, so, um, do I get the achievement, or...? Do I not get it? What? What? No? I'm upset. He trolled us. That's interesting. That's something. Oh. Oh. You got it. Okay, it's a Steam achievement. Well, it normally appears on my screen. You know, like the bottom when right Stanley corner? When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, you know. he entered the door on his left. That's interesting, because just now, that input thingy was in the first room. Yet, there was not a single person here either. That is interesting. A wave of dis if I begin the game again, and I find that thing again, All of his co-workers were gone. Huh? What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. What? I feel like something is off here, Chad. This game is so gold. Cool. I'm so confused. What's up, your little bro? The, 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 the. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his okay. left. Okay. Yet the and if I begin the game again? Huh? Someone was following Stanley. He was sure of it. If he checked over his shoulder now, he would surely catch them. It was only a matter of time. Yeah. And all the desks are... I think a little more than the desks were gone there, buddy. Where did the thing go? Does it only happen when... When does it happen? When Stanley came to a huh. set of two open doors... Have we tried? We have tried going to the corner and right. We just go to, like, this lounge area. You know? Very silly. Yet there was not a single so person we go here, here either. Feeling a wave of disbelief, and we go Stanley back down. decided to go up to his boss's office. Coming to a staircase, Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's office. Yeah. Door opens, everything turns off. Here's the door, just go. We go through. We press the button. We escape again, right? What happens then? And we come back. 
I'm definitely missing something, and I don't know what it is. I don't know how to unmiss it. Stanley walked straight ahead through the large door that read Mind Control Facility. Although this passageway had the word escape written on it, yeah. the truth was that at the end of this hall, Stanley would meet his violent death. So if I go down and the I go to that same him area, was not shut. Stanley still had every opportunity to turn around and get back on track. Or at this maybe point, Stanley after was I making a conscious, hole, concerted effort to walk forward I go back. and willingly confront his death. No, it's okay. I'll go all the way through again, and I'll go back to the place, and I'll find input. Right? Right? Surely that's how you do this. Surely that's how you play the game. Surely. As the machine so whirred into motion, so Stanley was I'm inched so closer and closer to his demise. He reflected that his life had been of Hi, no hello. consequence I'm whatsoever. Confused. Stanley can't see the bigger picture. He doesn't know the real story, trapped forever in his narrow vision of what this world is. Perhaps his death was of no great loss, like plucking the eyeballs from a blind man. And so oh. he resigned and willingly oh. accepted this violent end oh. to his brief and shallow life. Oh. Farewell, Stanley. Hi, confused. I'm pro. Hello. Oh. Farewell, Stanley. Cried, cried the, narrator, the narrator as Stanley was led helplessly into the enormous metal jaws. In a single yeah. visceral instant, Stanley was obliterated as the machine crushed every bone in his body. Killing him instantly. Uh huh. And then I I die. I don't die. I go right through. I go right And yet through. it would be just a few minutes before Stanley go back. would restart the game back in his office as alive as ever. What exactly did the narrator think he was going to accomplish? I don't when know. When every I path don't you know. can walk has been created for you long in advance, death becomes meaningless, making life the same. Do you see now? Do you see that Stanley was already dead from the moment he hit start? It's okay. I'm okay with this. This is fine. We go right through. <laughs> Click the button. Oh, look at these two. And then we restart. How they wish to destroy one another. How they wish to control one another. How they both wish to be free. Okay, okay, okay. Can you okay. see? No, 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 no. Can you see how much they need one another? No, I cannot see. No, perhaps not. Sometimes these things cannot be seen. <laughs> but listen to me. You can still save those two. You can stop the program before they both fail. Push escape and press quit. There's no other way to beat <laughs> As long okay. as you move forward, you'll be walking someone else's path. Stop. Begin the game again. And we're back here. How long was I sitting there? Stanley wondered to himself. Minutes? Days? Centuries? Where's the input thing? Did something crucial happen while my Where'd senses go? were turned? He made a note to be more careful with time from now on. What? It's still not here? Okay, I... Uh... Uh-huh. EP's time for me. Good night, Evil. Have a lovely... When Stanley we came to a set right. of two open doors... This was not the correct way to have the meeting room. Have a great team, have a lovely night. Well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first. Just to admire it. Wow. Yes. This room. What a beautiful room. What a gorgeous, gorgeous room. Thank goodness Stanley had taken this detour on his way to the meeting room. Life without having experienced this room was now too hot. But eager to get back to business, Stanley took the first open door on his left. Eh, uh, what if I just keep going? Eight. Stanley was so bad at following directions, it's incredible he wasn't five years ago. We we got somewhere! We We got somewhere! I'm so fucking smart. God, everyone loves me. Everyone wants to give me a big kiss on the lips.
They look at me and they go, wow, cow, you are the definition of a beautiful, beautiful man. And I go, thank you. I know. Okay. New space, let's go. Look, Stanley, I think perhaps we've gotten off on the wrong foot here. Yeah? I'm not your enemy, really, I'm not. Yeah. I realize that investing in your trust in someone else can be difficult, but the fact yeah. is that the story has been about nothing but you. Oh, I fell! All this but in his eagerness to prove that he is in control of the story and no one gets to tell him Fuck, what to I do, fell. Stanley leapt from the platform and plunged to his death. Whoopsies! Good job, Stanley. Everyone <gasps> thinks you're very powerful. I didn't mean to do that. A soft wind blew outside and perhaps rain started. Uh, and if it did, it stopped shortly uh, after. Stanley hoped that he would one day see weather. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, this was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. The lounge was sublime, a work of art. But eager to get back to business, Stanley took the first open door on his left. I'm Stanley was so, so bad at following happy. directions. It's incredible he wasn't fine. I'm years not ago. sad. Look, Stanley, monologue is changing though. Bitch, he's always here. I'm not your enemy, really. I'm not. I hate him. I really I do. That in your trust I really in do hate him. Difficult. But the fact is that the story has been about nothing but you all this time. There's someone you've been neglecting, Stanley. Someone you've forgotten about. Please, stop trying to make every decision by yourself. Now, I'm not asking for me. I'm asking for her. Who's her? It, Stanley. Your chance to redeem yourself. To put your work aside. To let her back into your life. Who's She's her? been waiting. Who's her? Who's her? My wife? Oh. That's her, Stanley. You need to be the one to do this. To reach out to unplug. her. Unplug. If you Oh no, 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 you can't. Did you just unplug the phone? <laughs> well, that wasn't supposed to be a choice. How did you do that? You actually chose incorrectly? I didn't even know that was possible. <laughs> Let me double check. Yeah, oh, bitch! It's definitely here, clear as day. Nice. Stanley picks up the phone. He's taken to his apartment where he finds his wife and the two, two pledge themselves, themselves to one another. another. Music Brat comes energy, in, thank you. fade to white, roll credits. Not picking up the phone is actually somehow an incorrect course of action. Yeah. How is that even possible? What are you gonna do about None it? of these decisions were supposed to mean anything. I don't understand. How on earth are you making meaningful choices? <laughs> what did you wait a second? Have no did fear the see? Rizzlers. No, that's not possible. I can't believe it. What did you see? How had I not noticed it sooner? What's up? You're not Stanley. You're a real person. I am. <sighs> I can't believe I was so mistaken. You were. This is why you've been able to make correct and incorrect choices. Yeah. And to think I've been letting you run around in this game for so long. Yeah. If you've made any more wrong choices, you might have negated <laughs> it entirely. It's as though you completely ignored even the most basic safety protocol Bro, I'm playing with real my world decision making. Or life. did you not grasp the severity of the situation? I did not grasp well, the severity I won't have of that the situation. Kind of risk on my watch. I'm going to stop the game for a moment so we can educate you properly on safe decision making in the real world. Yeah. Please observe this helpful instructional video. Yeah. Choice. Ooh. It's the best part of being a real person. Is that so? But if used incorrectly, it can also be the most dangerous. Damn. That's for example, crazy. in this scenario, a hypothetical real person named Rupert has a choice. He could invent a machine that eliminates food shortages across the world to make life better for all people. Or he could spend years of hard work forgetting how to read. Which choice would you make? Remember that unlike here, the real world makes sense. And at no time should you make a choice that does not conform to rational logic. If you find yourself speaking with a person who does not make sense, in all likelihood, that person is not real. That's Allow interesting. the person to finish their thought, then provide an excuse why you cannot continue talking. Turn to a partner and practice saying, 
My goodness, is it 4:30? My goodness, I'm is it 4:30? I'm supposed to be having a back second, second crack. crack. Second crack. Excellent. Wait, that's not Making even... choices on a regular basis oh. is the best part oh, of a wow. healthy decision-making process. Ooh. Most medical Embrace professionals chaos. recommend making Look at, at your least keyboard. eight choices There's per day. Do you make more than eight? You. Less? Safuido and finally, high. if you begin to wonder if your choices are actually meaningful, meaningful. and whether you'll ever make a significant contribution to the world, just remember that in the vast infiniteness of space, your thoughts and problems are materially insignificant. Oh, okay. And the feeling should subside. Okay. At this time, your instructor will guide you in an exercise to test and reinforce the material covered in this video. Uh-huh. Ah, welcome back. What the f- Huh? You may have noticed that this room has begun to deteriorate as a result of what? negative contradiction. But not to worry. What? Now that you're properly uh, informed on good uh, decision making, we're going to revisit a choice one you too made many just a few minutes here. ago and see what the correct thing I love to do this game. would have been. Yeah. This way, please. But I don't want to go. I don't want to go. Danger, danger everywhere. That's why I'll go. Oh, okay. I'm, 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 I'm going back. Oh, but I can't jump off if you do that. Up, 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 up. No, okay. Well, I really can't jump off of you. Now that we know your choices are meaningful, uh, we can't have you jumping what? off the platform and dying. But, Imagine the main wanna, character dying senselessly halfway but, through the story. But I see that the, story would make no, I, no sense I don't want to go. We just no, need to get you home as soon as possible no, I wanna, before the narrative I wanna see. I want to see what's in there. Uh, no, I don't want to go here. This place no. Is not well equipped no, 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 I want to go there. I want, I don't want, oh, okay. Can I go back? Okay. He's sending us back. He's so mean. He doesn't love me. Okay. I guess not. Okay. That's not creepy at all, man. That's... Okay. Well, my bad. I'll go back to the start. Almost there. You'll take the door on the left, back to the correct ending, the story will have resolution once again, and you'll be home free in the real I'm world. I'm upset. Now remember, all you need to do is behave exactly as Stanley would. Okay. That means choosing responsibly okay. and always putting the story okay. first. Okay, I can I'm do that. I'm quite sure you'll be up to the task. Yeah. Just follow my lead and you'll be fine. Okay. All right. <clears throat> When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Yay! <laughs> no! Why did you do that? Quickly, hurry back in the other direction. Perhaps oh, okay. we're not too late. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I go to the right. I, I didn't. And no, I'm so Oh, it's ruined. You, I can't believe, after everything we talked about, that you... My story! You've destroyed my work! Why? For what? What did you get out of that? What did you think was so special about seeing the game undone? Left here like so much garbage, it... Well, How do I get it's there? It's worthless now. And what am I How supposed do I get to do? There? Even if there were a way to continue, would it be worth it? To know that my story is now incorrect? How can I go back to that? I can't erase that knowledge. I'll have to live with it forever. How do I go back? It's impossibility forever. Oh, I couldn't live that way. Huh? Is it better to shut the game down entirely? To willingly destroy all of my work? I don't know. What's the answer? What do I do? What do I do? What do I... No, I have to. I have to shut what? the game down. No, I, I have to. I can't... I have to. Oh, oh, there I go. Hello? Oh, no. Oh, I don't like that. Huh? Oh, I'm here. I'm still here. Here in this pile of rubbish. With you. Oh, you, I'm scared. You thought you were so clever. 
Now look where we oh, are. Oh, my I don't like this. Destroyed. Uh -huh. It was the only thing in the world that was mine, and you run it into the ground. I'm what sorry. did you think that would be funny? You oh. just had to see. Didn't I impress upon you how important it was to be like Stanley? He actually knows how to do what I tell him to. He understands that if I say to do something, there's a damn good reason for it. That thought hadn't even occurred to you, had it? That there's a world outside of you? You're a child. Oh, my story. If you'd just gone through the door on the left, you would have seen it. There was a whole underground facility. You would have destroyed it and been victorious. It would have been so perfect. I worked so hard on it. I tried so hard to make... Oh. ...is behave exactly as Stanley would. That means choosing responsibly... Yay, and we're back! ...and the story first. <laughs> I'm quite sure you'll be up to the task. Just follow my lead and you'll be fine. All right. <clears throat> When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, doors he entered, entered the, the door, door on his, on his left. left. No, 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 Why did you do that? Quickly, hurry back. Oh. Is behave exactly as Stanley would. That means choosing responsibly okay. and always putting the story yes. first. I'm quite sure you'll be up to the task. What if I just, just keep going? My lead and what would they do if I keep right. going? <clears throat> When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Bye. Is he looping us? I think so. No! Why did you do that? Quickly, hurry back. Is behave exactly as Stanley would. Why did it take a that bit from him to realize that? That's and weird. always putting the story okay. first. I'm quite sure you'll be up to the task. Just follow my lead and you'll be fine. Do I keep All disobeying? Right. <clears throat> when Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. I'll keep disobeying. No! Why did you do that? Quickly, hurry back. Ooh. Ooh, let's try. Let's behave exactly as Stanley would. That means choosing responsibly and let's always putting to the, left the story door. first. I'm quite sure you'll be up to I the task. Just follow my don't lead know and you'll be fine. All right. <clears throat> when Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Yeah. Yet there was not a single person here either. Feeling a wave of disbelief, oh, Stanley just... decided to go up to his boss's office, hoping he might find an answer there. What? Coming to a staircase, oh. Stanley oh. walked upstairs oh. to his boss's office. Huh? Oh, oh, Stepping hello, inside hello. his manager's office, Stanley was once again stunned to discover not an indication this is of any not human the life. Same. Shocked, unraveled, How's Stanley wondered I'm in confused. disbelief who orchestrated this until he saw the door with a voice receiver next to it. Surely behind this door lay all the answers to his questions. And beyond all probability, he knew the passcode. He had seen it on his boss's computer just last week. Night Shark 115. Was this the code to open the door? Would it still work? There was only one mm. way to find out. Stanley wow, had been trained new. never to speak up, but now he would draw from within himself the courage to face the unknown. He drew a sharp breath and, and then spoke, spoke the, the code. code. Shark? 115 Shark? Uh. 115 Stanley spoke the code. Oh. Night Shark 115. Night Shark 115. Right there. Night on the Shark 115. Night Shark 115. Night Shark 115. I'm sorry, is there a problem? You didn't mishear me, did you? I'm... Please speak the code into the receiver. Otherwise we can't get on with the story. This is a crucial step. Night Shark, one one five. Okay, fine. You're Blum. not gonna do it, but you know what? 
It's pretty humiliating to bring you this far, only for you to suddenly decide you have better things to do. I'm not... I asked you for this one single thing for your you respect. You speak into a mic? The kind I am of respect speaking into a mic. Stanley shows mic. for his choices. He knows what it means to take a story seriously. If you didn't want to see what I had to show you, then why did you come here? Because you're a bitch. You had a choice, you know. You could have gone through the door on the right. You could have done whatever the <laughs> hell you wanted over there. Why did you come this way? Speak. Yeah. Say something to me. Explain yourself, you coward. You... Oh. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors... Oh, shit. He entered the door on his left. Hello? S Stanley? Stanley? Hello? Hello? Oh, no. <laughs> Is everything okay? Stanley, please. I I need you to make a choice. The, the end. I need you to walk through the door. Oh. Are you listening? Is that me? it? Can I beat the game? Me? Is everything all right? Stanley, this is important. The story needs you. It needs you to make a decision. It cannot exist without you. Do you understand me? One's a narrator whimpering. I hate some more coming here. out. You can work <laughs> I'll accept whatever you do. I not, I, I don't believe it. I, be I don't believe that I've beaten the game. Have I? Did I really beat the game? This is more important than you can ever know. I need this. Sorry, I need to control myself real quick. I need to behave. I need to behave, because if I don't behave, I'll act up. The story needs it. <sighs> so, you hear me? They're just simping are so there? hard. Are you listening to this? Stanley, are you there? I'm... Okay. It's okay, I can wait. Oh. time to decide. That's one ending. Time to make sure your choice is correct. That is the best choice. Who's Leroy? That's all right. I'll wait for you to decide what's the right thing to do. Take as much time as you need. Is... Is that it? Oh! All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? What? Stanley decided to go to the huh? meeting room. Perhaps How long is to be insulted? It's kind of fun at you. Yeah, yeah. New content. Oh, new content? What does that mean? New content. Oh. 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 Interesting. New content. The narrator sounds like the narrator from LBP. What's LBP? Hello, and thank you for playing the Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe. Yeah. As you may know, the Stanley Parable was a video game released in 2013 on home computers. Mm hmm. After receiving critical and commercial success, it was expanded upon in 2022 with the Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe, a reimagining of the game for consoles and home computers. The Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe features exciting new content that broadens and expands the world of the Stanley Parable, delighting audiences the world over. Please, step inside and see what thrilling new adventures await in The Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe. Okay. Oh, well, new content, let's delightful. go. I'm very excited to see the thrilling new Ultra Deluxe content. Okay, okay. so far it's an elevator. Okay. Nothing we special yet, but I'm sure it's just the beginning of a mesmerizing adventure. Yeah, sure. I am stuck. Um... Is it broken? What's going huh? on here? Should we... Should we be moving somewhere or... or oh, there we go. All right, finally, at long last, it's on to the new content. I've never been oh, more ready. Eepy. Let's do it. We got this. Hmm. Hmm. I have to say, initial impressions of Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe. Mostly tedious. It's as if... Um, oh, okay. Let's see the content. Give me oh, the content, hello. Stanley. Okay. The jump All right. circle. All right, let's see. It's the jump circle.
Is this bad? What's your opinion on allergies? I don't like them. I have a pistachio allergy. I'm upset! Is... is that it? Surely that's not all the new content. There has to be something else, right? My jumps! Another elevator. Stanley, I have to say, initial impressions of this game are not positive. I'm upset! Just My jumps! I lost them! Is this what passes for exciting new content? That sucks! Pistachios are awesome, content, right? I could just read you the whole dictionary. There's 20 hours of new content right there. Oh. Now, I could count to 30 trillion. You could put that on the box. The Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe, now with over a thousand hours of new content. And if... Oh, wait. There's Yippee! more. Very good. Yes. I knew there had to be something else. Oh. Let's see it. I'm ready for whatever it is. Thank you for enjoying. Thank you. That's it? Oh, you've got to be kidding me. You see, Stanley? This is what happens when greedy video game developers with no respect for their fan base rush a cheap expansion to market for no reason other than to make an easy dollar. And don't get me started on the level of craftsmanship that's gone into it. In fact, I'm looking right now at the game's achievements, and it's hard to believe one of them actually says, Test achievement, please ignore. What quality assurance department signed off on this? I'm infuriated oh, and I'm oh. offended, and I, I intend to find these people on Twitter and hold them personally accountable. <sighs> it's my fault, Stanley. I built up too much anticipation around the new content, I'll just stay I'm here. afraid. It could never have lived up to such expectations. If you're still with me, why don't we just reset the game and we'll try to get back to what the Stanley parable is really about. What if we say no? No frills, no gimmicks. Just you and me having a great time together like always. What do you say, friend? No thanks. I like this. Oh! Huh. Oh. Psst! Stanley! Come over here! In the vent! I want to show you something! Yeah? Ooh. Okay. He would love that, wouldn't he? He would. Maybe I'd love that. Maybe I love him. <laughs> okay, you remember how cheap and unsatisfying the new Ultra Deluxe content turned out to be? Mm -hmm. Well, it got me thinking about the past and how much better the Stanley Parable used to be. So I made something special and tucked it away here where the game's developers won't find it. Just oh! our little secret. Take a look. Whoa! I call it the memory zone. Yo! It's where I've been storing all my favorite memories so I can relive the peak Aww. experiences of my life whenever I want. Experiences like the launch of the Stanley Parable on PC. You see, Stanley, doesn't the memory zone remind you of how wonderful Stanley Parable was before it was sullied with a cheap re-release? Remember back in October of 2013 when the game originally launched? Back then, video games had integrity. Back then, it all meant something. Oh, the waste. I can't even sit there, okay. Cool. And over here is where I keep reviews of the Stanley Parable. Like this stunning triumph of games journalism. 10 out of 10 from Destructoid.com. James Stephanie Sterling writes, and I quote, where so many games Fuck. that aspire to be more than games end up less than any form of art, huh? Stanley Parable strives and then huh? succeeds to be huh? every game ever created. Did you hear that, Stanley? Every game ever created. That's how grand and all-encompassing the original Stanley Parable was. It was literally every game ever created. It was Skyrim. It was Persona 3. It was all of them. And get now, out. it's nothing. It's no games at all. Can't yeah, get out. It isn't even the Stanley Parable anymore. I want to get out. It's just a husk now. A lifeless husk with an hour of new elevator content. Ooh. Okay, I'm not going to go down there because it looks scary. Here's another moving passage. Yo. This time from GameSpot.com. 
The Thank you for the fall for the fall procrastination. Highly appreciate stimulating it. commentary on the nature of choice in games and one that mm -hmm. offers some of the most enjoyable, surprising, and rewarding choices I've ever been confronted with in a game. Nine out of ten. Don't you get it, Stanley? The game was perfect. It didn't. Wait. I have things to do, if I am going to be honest. I have a few things to do, might have to do them. I will end the stream around now. Yeah, chat. <laughs> I'll play the Stanley Parable again. Maybe, maybe not. Who knows, right? Um, but I really have to go because I have things to do. And, you know, can't really do them if I'm playing a game. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So, I want to thank you all for being, for being here on the stream, for enjoying my stream. I, yeah. But that you should play it again. I, I should play it again. Yeah, 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 yeah. Mm -mm -mm. I had fun. I had fun. I had fun. I had fun. Mostly confused, but I had fun. I had fun. Mm -mm -mm. I hope you guys come to my. Oh, tomorrow I'm actually gonna have a collab stream. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. First collab with another VTuber. I want you guys to guess who it is. <laughs> it's Evil. I <laughs> I'm collabing with Evil. Mm -mm. And we'd be like, Cow, but your other friends are, are VTubers. They're PNG tubers. I mean Life 2D, okay? It's exciting. Both our models are gonna be in the same room together. It's like a crossover episode, okay? Yeah. Isn't that exciting, chat? Aren't you excited? Aren't you excited? Aren't I so innovative and never boring and repetitive? Yeah, yeah, you like that, right, chat? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Please spare my confidence. But yeah, no. Uh, I will go raid someone. Who should I raid? I should raid. I. Let's raid Tayo. Let's raid Tayo, Jen. Okay. I'm, I'm gonna head out, chat. I love you guys. Uh, follow me on my socials. I post like an hour or more before streams usually. To tell you guys when uh, my streams are, and I am mentally stable, but only ninety nine percent of the time. Hopefully, you like that. Okay, I'm. 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 I'm, 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 I'm